This is David, Kilo Kilo 4, Mike November Delta in, Dave, in uh, Clearwater, Florida, uh, with my dad Raymond here. And uh, we're getting ready to break ground on uh, my tower, my 40 foot tower that I'll be installing. Um, we're here in uh, good old Clearwater, Florida. So, here we go. Here we go. Alright, All right, well, here we are. About an hour and a half, two hours later. We're about uh, 36 inches deep here. I think we're gonna stop right about here. We're gonna go up a little bit. We're gonna build a frame around here and it's gonna go about six inches higher than that. We did uh, run into a little problem, but not too big of a problem. Sprinkler system. But we're gonna cut that. <laughs> And we're going to reroute it around the back side of the tower, or maybe the front. We'll see. Uh, but that's not going to be a problem. Oh. So we're uh, working on the rebar frame that's going to go inside the hole. It's uh, about four, inches, four feet tall. Uh, and then uh, we used uh, two foot long rebar across the sides. And we got these wires, wire ties here. And we're just going to... We're just gonna wrap the, wrap the tie around and use this trusty tool here. And you're gonna pull while you spin around and it's gonna lock it into place. And we got your, we got the frame here now. So this will go inside the hole and uh, we're gonna hammer it, mallet it down. Um, so this is, almost uh, a little bit below, a couple inches below the top of the structure, uh, the top of the, the base of the concrete. And um, then we're gonna put our bolts in the center that are gonna hold the base plate. We'll have to build a frame on top to keep the bolt, the threaded rods um, free floating here. And then we're gonna pour it all concrete. And uh, we'll see you in a, a day or two because uh, the truck's not coming today. It's gonna come uh, maybe sometime next week. Well, this is what uh, where we're at. All right. These are the templates for the base plate. Template for the base plate and our aft and forward support. All right, the base plate, and we're gonna tilt the tower that way. I got about 25 feet till I hit that structure there, and that right there is gonna be our our F support. We'll put a winch on that, and it'll lower the tower. Well, today's the day. Concrete truck is here, and we have the hardware in place as you can see the anchors are 12 inches long and uh, got just enough thread exposed um, and a little dark in there but you get the idea you got the aft support back there and then a uh, forward support here and we're gonna start pouring here there we go we got all the concrete poured in there. We had to do it by wheelbarrow because the truck couldn't fit in here. But uh, this is after day one. Bring the bit back. So you got to bring the bit back. This bracket's going to be a reinforcement. Well, we 
got the ass support with the winch up and we got the rudder in and for now we just put a little dual band uh, cubic beam up top until uh, finish working on the Mosley sections and we get the diplexer feeding it down to stand off to keep the coax from getting caught up the rotor gives you a G800 Alright, we're back at it today, the tower project, we got all our supports set up on the tower, all the new winches and everything, and uh, new uh, cables and the pulley systems to lift the top section and for our locking mechanism to hold the, the top, this top section up. Uh, Yezu rotors installed mast and we have two sections of uh, the Mosley TA53 on and we're gonna have we bolted these two up gonna tilt it up rotate it tilt it back down and install the other two sections KK4MND Clearwater Florida